are all three of these from the same release? Yes. Okay. Uh, my name is Logan Brown, and well, how should I say that? My latest release is called You Should Live With As Much Guilt As I Do. I tried my best to earnestly express um, embarrassing emotions with these songs and then on the like ensuing record. So I just decided to write down exactly what I thought and felt um, despite all of my personal judgments about those things. Because um, in the past I've hidden meaning and metaphor and I wanted to be much more straightforward this time around. And you uh, have a studio at home or you recorded it all yourself. What is your recording process like? Right. For this collection of songs anyway? For this collection, uh, I didn't have access to a drum set throughout the year 2020 and so I experimented with sampling. So all the percussion is um, home samples of like cardboard boxes and coffee mugs and old drum samples um, and the guitar is all also digital like in the audio workstation so uh, despite it being kind of a loud and aggressive record at times it was recorded very quietly and Ohio Family Murder is the first one yes the name Ohio it was just heavily inspired by uh, Jason Molina of Songs Ohio and the Magnolia Electric Co. Um, was listening to a lot of his music and grabbed a line of his and started writing lyrics to it and uh, the music came after. I, I guess over the course of 2020, which is when these songs were written, um, I was just, as the world was, presented with a lot of death, um, both, like I said, like in public life, but also in my immediate life. Uh, I lost an aunt and a cat and then some figurative deaths occurred, um, kind of not just like within myself, but between myself and some other like close relations. And um, so these songs ended up darker than maybe previous releases, um, just because that's where I was at. Um, and the song especially, I guess, um, has that violent death theme. Uh, <laughs> So. Cold 
killer makes a heartbeat pop to the beat of dampened drums. Cause watch me now. Watch it now. Once you start it off with a drop of a pin. Notes and kneading, yeah. It's the particularly like sunny sounding. It does sound really sunny, like right? Yeah. Uh, I wrote that cheery chord progression, and I was like, "Oh, this is happier than anything I think I've written so far." And then I had a poem, and it was just a heavy contrast uh, as far as lyrical content went. So I paired them together. So it's a, a pop song about depression, <laughs> which. Uh, Music has been more of an outlet for my negative emotions um, than the positive. I find it maybe easier to express the positive than the negative. So, um, yeah, those filter through more easily. Da 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 
Sandbox is, yep, the third song we recorded. Um, it, 2020, again, being so isolated, I guess naturally a lot of reflection happened. Um, so that song mentions a lot of past events um, and like physical and emotional scars. And um, it, it's kind of pathetic. <laughs> Um, just like wishing for um, innocence and that kind of thing. My thumb fucked my tendon in the back room of a store Bleeding badly grabbed a towel, me and my friend flew out the door He was paid for by a company called Helmsman or something Like they used to forge real armor, but now they just pay for thumbs Being mortal, paying court order Payments cause you spray painted your high school when you were 16 Show those assholes who was false while wearing homemade masks Forge a secret in your bedroom, you stuck your little finger Bleeding badly, dead skin mask, while you sobbed inside your hole Empty longing, am I realer than this rotting stomach full? Having issues, thinking you're a fucking loon Praying to Vishnu, a year or two later Thinking God's inside your head, and all you gotta do is dread All the feelings and the wantings making you wish for your bed should be wiser, but just pouring scared dryer Drink the water that we give you, it'll surely cure your head Deadly headache, pulsing cranium of dread Should be calmer, but I'm an enemy instead Of free living, thoughtless giving Things the wise men taught and said Am I acting well? Would you tell me? Or is it no?
Uh, as I was saying, I fucked up my thumb, uh, November 2019, uh, throwing trash away. Um, someone must have thrown away a razor blade or something, so I have these like really gross scars on my thumb here and on my hand. Because uh, my tendon actually snapped and then uh, ended up down in my wrist. So they had to cut my thumb open in my wrist and then feed my tendon back up into my thumb. And uh, I was pretty positive I was never going to play guitar again. Because I, I couldn't bend my thumb and I was like, okay, like it's, it's totally fucked. But uh, I can't. I just can't straighten it all the way. So I had to like re relearn how to strum and pick because my, my thumb's probably like a centimeter lower. So, so I ended up having to like move more, which was really weird. Uh, but it all worked out.